you think Yahya Sinwar is a terrorist, right? Yeah. And there was an arrest warrant request for Yahya Sinwar mm. from the International Criminal Court Chief mm. Prosecutor Kareem mm. Khan, British lawyer. Mm. He's also put out an arrest warrant for Benjamin Netanyahu. Mm. He's accused Netanyahu, who, well, he's asked for one. The court is being lobbied not to do it. Mm. He's, he's put out an arrest, he's asked for an arrest warrant, and the indictments he's put out include, this is what he's accused Netanyahu of, starvation, mm. murder, willful killing, extermination. How is Netanyahu mm. not a terrorist, Brick Pierce? Well, it may end up being that he is convicted of war crimes that suggest he's a terrorist. But Sinwar hasn't been, wasn't convicted of... Well, Sinwar... I'm just right? being consistent. The ICC chief prosecutor well, put let out me be consistent about to you. for both. Here's the difference. Hamas no, made no secret of what they did on October the 7th. Sinwar directed and ordered that attack. No one Nor disputes is that. No, yeah, but what, what, what the, the difference is that Hamas said, here are the GoPro cameras. We are going to show the world what we're doing here. So is Israel. I, well, just, showed you, I just mentioned a video where a kid is killed on camera. Yeah. In fact, Israeli soldiers have put out TikToks Listen, of their war crimes. Please. You're not going to get me to say that what Israel's been doing is terrorism, because I believe they are defending Why not, people. though, is what I'm wondering. But because, it seems to be just a stubborn resistance. Because any country in the world that had October the 7th perpetrated against them would do what Israel has done. No, they because, wouldn't. Yes, they would. They would have killed kids on this level. No, if you had literally a country on your border... Well, it's not a country on your border, it's occupied territory. I think you've conceded yourself in previous I have actually said to you, I believe it was, it is occupied territory. Okay, then, so it's not a country on your border. Let's call it, what do you want to call it? Occupied territory. Well, let's call it Gaza, okay? Okay. That on one single day, in 13 different entry points, 3,000 people came through and committed as much mayhem and murder as they could possibly commit in a deliberate attempt to destabilise and take down Israel which is the, the uh, intention of their original charter. If that happened on any border, shared border, in the world, there is no country in the world that would not have responded with military force in the way that Israel has A, done. I don't agree so, with so, that. So my, so my but, question, let, but let me say you're right. Well, every question, country would have done that. Does it make question, it not terrorism? No, my, but then what you're saying is that any country that then goes after terrorists that perpetrate that kind of attack automatically no. themselves well, hang on automatically themselves become terrorists no I, I dispute that categorization no, I'm, I'm saying that's a straw man well, I'm give, saying give you an example defend, where they're not terrorists. i just gave you an example they could have responded to hamas without attacking a kid killing the kid and when people come to rescue him attacking them as well i can give you i can be here all day we don't have the time so when, i can when, go through they couldn't have, they didn't need to attack when an american apartment building. Forces, when american forces, we're not doing what about ism we're not doing what about oh, When they went after ISIS, yeah. but they killed a lot of innocent yes. children in the process. I think those were acts terrorism. of war crimes. I think war crimes are acts terrorism. of terrorism. Yes. So if you go after... I don't think... I don't think so if you go after any terror group in the world... No, I'm saying if you... In, uh, hold on, Piers. The uh, definition of terrorism, according to every dictionary, mm. is the use of political violence against civilians mm. for political goals. Mm. That is what Netanyahu is doing. He said it openly. Israelis have said it on your show. Well, he's responding that, to a terrorist attack. By doing more terrorism. Like, I don't he's killed 33 but times like, as many people as Yahya Sinwar. Let me be clear. But Sinwar's a terrorist and not Netanyahu. Netanyahu should absolutely no longer be Prime Minister of Israel. Should he be at the ICC? Uh, probably, yeah. So yeah. if the warrant comes I down, do, you support the UK arresting him if he comes to the UK? I absolutely you... think that his, his alleged war crimes, okay. and I use that because they've not been substantiated, his alleged war crimes should absolutely be investigated. This doesn't make any well, sense. You know, I, agree. I agree with you. No, no, no. We, I agree with you that they haven't been substantiated, mm. but I'm being consistent. I'm saying everyone, Hamas, Israel, mm. should be substantiated in investigation. Mm. You're saying one side's terrorists based on GoPro, but the other side's not terrorists, even though we've watched them kill thousands of people on camera. Literally, I've seen it. I saw them gun down an Hamas, old lady holding Hamas, a white flag. Hamas have made no secret that what they did was terrorism. Nor of Israel. Have you listened to Israeli mm. soldiers? You should watch our documentary. It's called mm. Israel's Real Extremism. It shows it. Israeli soldiers talking proudly about what they've it. done in